just uh, given uh, what the the podcast is called, what is a good life? Um, just really curious, um, and the the significance of what you do with the proceeds of the of the books, and also even with with regards to to CD Baby, obviously as well. Where where is this sense of you know giving giving back, paying it forward, whatever, like just contributing to the world? Um, to the extent that you do with these endeavors, like that's, that's quite unique. I, I when you know, usually when you think of people giving something, it's a percentage. Um, where, where has this come from for, for you, if you know what I mean, <laughs> that it's just like release again, I guess. <laughs> oh, hundred percent is also yeah, a percentage. True, true. <laughs> uh, <laughs> to me, it's just rational. I'm actually not an extremely bleeding heart, altruistic, sappy person. <laughs> it's just rational that if you had a cupboard uh, full of, I don't know, 50 cans of baked beans because you have baked beans every morning and you've got a cupboard full of 50 and somebody shows up at the door saying, uh, got another 150 cans of baked beans here. <laughs> And if your cupboard was full, you'd say, hey, can you give them to somebody else? I just don't need any more baked beans. I'm all set. Um, it's really just that. I already know that I have enough. I d there's nothing stupid I want to buy. I don't want um, a mega yacht. So if more money shows up at the door when my needs are already filled, it just feels stupid to take it for myself it feels like it should just go to people that need it like there are people who really need money right now and i'm not one of them so please don't give it to me that's i i just think that's um it's an amazing perspective the the sense though as well of just it, it being rational it's kind of it's it's irrefutably kind of rational <laughs> um <laughs> <laughs> thank you so, i agree but but it also just kind of makes me reflect on a little bit then just the maybe even the craziness of our ideology or our culture sometimes that that just I've never heard someone describe their like an altruistic um, act like that as just rational. But I I don't know I think there's something really pointed or or weighty to what you just said there. Thank you. I I try to understand the world. I try to understand different worldviews. I try to understand worldviews that are that conflict with my own and, and really try to understand them. This one I still don't get. I still don't understand why Jeff Bezos builds the world's largest mega yacht, <clears throat> to use that previous example. I don't understand why somebody who has four houses needs to buy a fifth one uh, i don't i don't understand needing 35 cars you know for those people that get way into cars i just don't get it and i i actually really would like to get to know one of these people which may be hard because usually if somebody's that rich then they are very um emotionally guarded too or they're used to kind of talking in public platitudes, like saying what people want to hear instead of being honest. I'd love to try to get into the honest psyche of somebody making those decisions and try to understand what is it really? Like, where is that really coming from? 